There is only one of you here. You are the consciousness. You are all there is. Everything you see outside, it is only your world pushed out. There is only one game called consciousness. And in this game, in this reality, in this earth, it's all about how much more can you be aware? How much more can you be present? Because to the level of how conscious and present you are, it is going to uh, be the level of your quality of life. Why I call my lifestyle seven stars lifestyle. Why I Maya seven stars? Because that's the level that I'm aware of, that I play on the highest level, which I invite you to do. Only trouble, and you will always have the trouble if you don't take the time to team the beast. And in this video, I'm going to share with you uh, simple things uh, why and how to team the beast. So, your beast is this mind that uh, thinks it knows all, you know, and it's all run under the program that is installed by default, by error, by Russian roulette. Your life and your programs that you run on is the product of the plain sheer circumstances of all the people that you went through in your growing up, everyone is told this, that, this, that, and you just take it, take it, take it, take it, and then voila, when you're 20 years old, you think you're ready for your life, where indeed you are this bundle of God knows what kind of programs, and if you don't take the time to install those programs, you will always be a victim, your, your life will always be drama, you will never be happy because what happens when you go unconscious? <sighs> Even for you, for many of you that you awaken, which you are on this channel, obviously, you think that you are aware, but you are not even aware till that, to which level much more that you can be aware. And for that, I will give you a, you know, simple exercise as, you know, night before you go and do the, you know, um, put the al uh, random alarm clocks on your, on your phone. And so next morning next day when any of those alarm clocks go on ask yourself where are you are you conscious or you're not conscious what, what are you creating what are you thinking what is the pico universe that you are building right there you zoomed out because you have been born and bred in this upside down universe where where what is uh, predominant it is the unconsciousness Right now, just now, which I, which I shared in my previous video about the Kali Yuga and that, and what it actually means, watch that video if you're interested. So now the real consciousness is coming back, but it's also on your individual level, right? How are you going to play that? Because it's easy to get unconscious because you have been born into the conscious mind in world. So first you need to understand one thing. It's so simple, guys. I promise to you, everything is so simple in this world. So when you go unconscious, what happens? What happens? Your installed program pick up. And then you go cruising. You go cruising on autopilot, right? Great. Well, great if you have great pro uh, programs in there installed. So when you go unconscious, those programs pick up. But if <laughs> chances are your programs are, you know, Russian roulette and all these, you know, <laughs> things that you installed. So it's, it's no different than, uh, you know, you have this, uh, for example, uh, program installed driving a car right and then you go unconscious how many times have you driven home and when you when you arrive home you're like 
oh my god i don't even remember the journey this is how profound this beast is right you can be driving for hours on end and arrive home safely safe and sound and you don't even remember why because your beast you know put your put yourself your consciousness you put on cruising right and those programs picked up and you you driven home automatically which is great in this right in this instance but when you don't have those uh, beneficial programs if there is you know program that <laughs> you know when you go offline when you go unconscious which will happen until you fully become aware and consciousness on its on on your own because you're in this individual game but what if your if your uh program was there when you go offline that you go and crash into the first tree which is <laughs> you know for most of you here it's about you know those signature chemical cocktails that i talk about because you're chemical beings which needs to change you you will want to watch this videos on my playlist uh everyone is a junkie you are a junkie everyone is a junkie you will always be a junkie you will always have this signature chemical cocktail as i call it because you are in this biological vessel and so what are the programs that are installed in there? You know, are they going to, uh, you know, pick up where you left off when you go unconscious, when you go cruising, or they're going to, you know, are you going to hit in the first tree there because that's the program. Because most of the people program, you know, is self-sabotage, you know, pinch of self, you know, self-pity, self, pity, self uh, I already said self-sabotage was my favorite you know, victimhood, you know, and then when you go on autopilot and when you, when you, when, when those uh, programs are activated, then you being this consciousness and where your focus goes, wherever your energy flows, where it flows, this is exactly what are you creating. So what are you creating? You know, can you afford what are you creating? Because where are you a majority of the time, this is what you're going to see manifest in this world. Because this world, this material world, is only a reflection of what is happening inside of you. So what is happening inside of you? How much more can you be aware? That's the game. That's the name of the game. And then when you go unconscious, which will happen, how do you know that you're going to fall back on those on those uh, beneficial programs. How do you know? Well, what I just said. Do this for a month. Do this for a month and write down your found findings. You will be mind blown to see, you know, when the alarm clock rings, where are you at? I, I done this long time ago. These things work and I'm always doing this with my people. So I know. And you are like, you are like, oh my God. You know, I just, you know, went on the, on that, train thought you know and because you have 17 seconds it's proven right that is the thing that was taken away from think and grow rich and i think in secret whatever but the thing is the thoughts are magnetic and then when you entertain one kind of thought positive or negative doesn't matter it's polarized and then take 17 seconds for the thought just like it to come along and then thought like just like it to come along so if it's negative thought right it's going to be a next thought a next thought and then <laughs> there you go down the drain right? <laughs> with all those like oh my god panic panic and then you are like oh my god i have all these panic attack attacks well what are you thinking like you cannot be having panic attacks if you are here you know, thinking, oh my God, life is so beautiful. And then another thought, oh, life is really so beautiful. Oh, it's so abundant, so prosperous. Because another great thing is you cannot, uh, you cannot serve two masters at the same time. You cannot sit on the two chairs in the same time. What that means? <laughs> it means that you cannot entertain positive and negative thought in the same time. So when you see yourself spiraling, it's because you're negative. But when you when you when you go on the positive thought, positive train, negative cannot come. 
So I like to say in my world, I say, sorry, I can't afford you. You know, when, you know, you know, I'm human as well, believe it or not, right? And sometimes, you know, the creepy thought comes in and I'm like, you know, like, and then I just, ah, there you little bugger. No, no, that's not going to fly in my universe. I'm not going to entertain you because I cannot afford you. Because I cannot indeed uh, afford to entertain any kind of thought because I know what happens next. This is, you know, what most of you experienced when, when you got uh, panic attacks. It's because like, <gasps> you go crazy, crazy thoughts. But, you know, if you just know that you cannot think positive and negative in the same time, then choose something positive and start training. Start training. This is what I call this period that everyone has to do. There is no work around that because you are this beast. And in this beast, it has mind wiring. It's literally physical brain that you need to rewire. Rewire. Physically, your brain is going to change. So, how do you do that? Repetition, 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 training. How do you team the beast? Takes time, doesn't it? Even you never think the beast, but you got the idea, right? It takes time, you know. It takes time until you, uh, you know, teach some uh, dog tricks. And little alone, old dog new tricks. You know, that would be like, oh my God. But it, but, but it can be done. And it can be done and there is no... Um, there is no, um, there shouldn't be discussion about it because without those beneficial programs, you have no legs to stand on. You will never have happy life. So this is the only work because you are a conscious being. You are actually aware of your thoughts and you are able to first, you have to use it, the share willpower. You have to, at first. But then, it will, it will be like a second nature. And you know, the things will start, things will start getting easier, 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 and repetition, repetition, day in, day out. You know, your brain is going to shape. For example, you know, back in the days, like, whatever you ask me, I'm, 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 that's my wiring. Whatever you ask me, uh, or whatever you share with me, and like, I can see that thing and I can tell you 100 reasons why this can be done, how this can be done, all the ways that this can be done, what is, if something, you know, they say, oh, this cannot be done. I can see uh, uh, all the ways around that thing so this can be done because there is solution to freaking everything. That's how my brain is wired. Where on the contrary, my, my husband, you know, whatever you ask him, whatever you say, like, he, he's wired like that, that he's going to give me instantly answer why this thing cannot be done, why this is impossible, oh, because of these rules, rules, and this and that, and I, in the same time, that's my wiring, <laughs> I see the solution to everything. This is where you need to uh, uh, train yourself and to do this work, you know, and then repetition, 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 and the same time you're removing those uh, detrimental, you know, not beneficial um, programs and installing something different because you cannot be just installing something because how we are the energy being and then whatever is energetically is taken away something needs to replace it this is why when i say for example energetically you only have enough of energy for a certain day and then you only have enough of energy to have this and this much friends you know, you have only enough of energy to, you know, last a day, you know, to have a couple of bursts of, of inspiration or whatever. Like, and then what you do with this energy, you, it, like this is what you have. The same in your mind, which is going to get physically revived. So one program is going to get is distilled because the other one is like a, it's like a, it's a record that you have to go, you know, over and over again until it's, until it's until it actually uh, returns it over there. And then, as a return, in return of this, your mind, your brain, your physical brain, physically rewires. Isn't that 
wow and you know like if you if you if you would took my brain and someone else's brain you would feel you would see actually different patterns this is why it's how your brain is firing you know and uh, and it's just gonna take time with a with a willpower to start changing that first thought and then second thought and then it's gonna go automatically you get what i'm saying and this is why you know uh, there is no other way to do this and that's that's actually the work that's the only work that you can get you know to this uh you know that, so so when you go unconscious your programs they gonna pick up and make it a breeze you know and you gonna create things that you want that you like whether you're driving whether you're sleeping whether you are eating because they they just run in a background and you're not gonna worry because sometimes you're just gonna go unconscious and you know that's 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 just a uh, part of this uh human experience but in order to do this is how much more can you be aware you know and how much more can you be in this present moment and, like you know and training yourself like you're not gonna be like watch yourself you know, when I do this 40, 40 days container, one-on-one -on -one with people, like, you know, when they get in container with me, they get so, um, so aware and they can see, you know, <laughs> all of the sudden, all the things, you know, the drama queen, the, the victimhood, you know, how they want the attention, things that they say, that they do around the closest people, there's not even them and they're like, you know, why I'm even doing this? You know, but because of all those programs, you want them to feel sorry for you. They want to say, oh, you poor you. Is this really who you want to be, poor you? No. You know, and it all comes down to these programs. And, you know, one of the things, it's about you uh, rewiring your brain. Uh, another thing that I will recommend you with all my heart, this book changed my life. I don't recommend it in full because the book is not completed, complete, you know, for a reason. But, you know, when it comes to understanding how, uh, why you have to think positive and all these things is the, bo is the book secret. A lot of things it was taken away from, from, uh, from there. But, you know, just for this purpose about, you know, uh, or how the thoughts create, you know, that's, that's still the best resource. Of course, you know, the Abraham Hicks, uh, Esther Hicks. Right. I love all her material. I would recommend 100 percent. I was listening to this back in the day, you know, because you will need you will need the time to rewire that you're going to need time to rewire the brain. And uh, what else I want to tell you, you know, for you that have a uh, physical chemical cocktails like addictions, you know, or, you know, so strong chemicals, which is you are a junkie doesn't matter which way you slice it we are all junkies because of these chemical cocktails but you know if you if that is uh manifesting in such a strong way in a physical world like you know panic attacks whatever uh high anxiety uh research the Wim Hof method the breathing because that's the easiest way the quickest way to get out of any addiction any addiction okay any any is that powerful that can reset your your uh, body, your mind, and help you in this process when you start getting anxious, when you start like, what are you thinking and start breathing because you will not be able to produce those thoughts as you are breathing and, you know, go for a walk, you know, like my people that are with me on counseling, it's really a lifestyle change, you know, and like you should be walking every day at least one hour if you don't have time for a walk of one hour your life sucks and it will always suck and if you don't have time then you should go for two hours every day for a walk because your body is designed to uh, walk and when you don't regulate your body or whatever, this is why you go crazy and all in your head. And this is why you have 200 kilos extra. This is why you drink. This is why you stoke, why you, you know, dope, why you, you know, numb yourself down. And, you know, when you just walk, if, you, if you're going to get a grounding shoes like I do, you know, and <laughs> just like doesn't matter, you know, what, what, what's going to happen. If I just go out and 10 minutes in the walk, I'm like, I'm already there like zen, like you know, I don't care, you know, really. Walk, guys, every day, you know, basic things like, you know, fresh air, staying in the nature, you know. Why <laughs> I put the camera over here so you can see my, my beautiful 
garden over here is massive and uh, it's very uh, special when this is flowering because it's beginning of spring here into the southern hemisphere there we go now and uh, you know so you know simple things as breathing <laughs> breathe you know walk sunshine water fire purification purifying your body with fire around the fire you know purifying your body like i, I was doing this instinctively for uh six years every night i do the salt baths the epsom salt baths and that actually clears your hot water opens your chakras and uh, it clears up all your all your uh, chakras you know clear us all, clears up your energy uh you know which is so beneficial you know and it's like a basic practice that you have to do you know another thing basic you know is this breathing uh basic why you know you should be getting up before the sunrise right another reason why they make it nine to five so you you are, you are totally busy around the day you never you don't get up when you know uh, when you are uh in the morning so the, you know like back in the days it was right five six o'clock you get up you finish work until two and then you have your i mean for people that are in the workforce i was never that kind of girl you know i find a way for myself which i invite you to do as well and um you know uh this way they enslave you you know all day long then you come back home and eat sleep and then you know go back again you know so that you can pay the house that you never <laughs> spend the time in and so on so teaming the beast is your work this work cannot be avoided it just can't be avoided it's your job to do it without that you have no legs to stand on you have to like if you're new to this stuff you're like you should be unprogramming you know doing these alarm clocks for the five years because you know until your your brain physically rewires itself it's gonna take time you know and for newbies over there like you have to have something to feed your mind with something positive for at least one hour a day every day you should be walking every day this is the work this is the investment i'm really big on investments Right? I always brag about, I always brag, I continue to brag about, I am here where I am because I invested 22 years in myself. I invested hundreds of thousands in myself. Just now in the in, in, in month of October, I'm investing 50,000 to do a crazy thing, to be one with God in an in a environment that I want to be in. And like That's the investment in myself. When you understand that you can only bank, only bet, on one person that's you the whole world is going to change you know spiritual people they're waiting for this system and the system no it's all in you this is not how your uh hero journey is going to be like oh we waited and then everything has been done for us and then we got all this money for our projects and now i can go and do great things no you create you create you start messy you start creating whatever it is and then God gives you a next thing, a next thing, a next thing, a next thing, a next thing. So, okay, so this is my seven stars. I'm here to help you get to your highest timeline. I'm here, timeline. <laughs> I'm here creating masters and I hope you're going to be <sighs> the next soul that I'm going to be working with because what I offer in my 40 days container is a shortcut for you. It's everything I've done in, in, in 22 years. And with this energy that I have available now and the energetic container that we open together, it is out of this world where I guide you every day, where my energy is with you every day and where I employ all of my gifts, which are many. So I love you and see you in my next video.